Hello, everyone. Uh, just a quick moment of real talk. Is that what the kids say these days? I'm not quite sure. I, I don't even know. I'm not that old, but, uh, you know, I just really haven't kept up with the times well. It happens. Anyways, uh, I was just thinking a little bit about, like, what I've done with playing so far and whatnot, and I really wanted to go caving, but I'm also, like, very scared of it for some reason. And I was just thinking, like, I used to be a pretty timid kid, um, and, like, never did things that I wasn't sure I was going to be good at the first time. Um, and I'm like, well, that's a sucky way to live. And, like, I don't do that anymore as an adult. Uh, but the problem is that I can't do many things now. And I was like, well, I can do stuff in Minecraft. Like, that is something that I can physically, as a human, do. And, like, why don't I? Why don't I do that more? Um... Like, if I die in Minecraft, there's very little consequence. I might lose a couple of things from my inventory or whatever, but, like, that doesn't matter. So, today, we're gonna, oh, gosh, we're gonna go caving. Yeah. Let's go do this! Come on! And get home before it gets dark, because I am still scared of monsters. Well, here we go. I need torches. Um, I went caving um, with my husband the other day because uh, he set up a LAN uh, world for us. Does that count as a server still? I'm not sure. I feel like I should know that. I took an atrocious amount of um, networking classes for my degree, but a good 50% of that just went in one ear and out the other, so I honestly could not tell you. But, like, I have actually only... No, I've never gone caving on my own before. Um, my I did make, like, one world for myself... Um, on the PlayStation. Alright, that's a creeper over there. And that's iron. I definitely need that. Uh, let's set up just a bit more light around first before I grab that. Um, so I do have, like, one world f that I set up on the PlayStation. Um, but even then, like, I found a lush cave but I did not explore it, except when my husband was standing right over my shoulder because it just freaked me out. I don't know, those caves, these caves are a little scary. Um, but yeah, uh, Carpe Diem is it, right? Seize the day? Let's do it. I would also like to brag that in our little world, um, I, whoa, I found the first diamonds. I was very proud of that. Oh, there's another creeper. See, creepers are really what scares me. I can handle the other guys mostly. Um, but those creepers. Okay, where, where was that zombie? I heard a zombie for sure. Oh, there he is. There he is. Come here, my friend. Let's take you out. <coughs> oh, there's another. Ha. Huh. Okay. I should have. Okay, these. I have been playing with my audio. <coughs> should see that coming. All right. Okay. Oh my gosh, I don't have anything. Let's get my heckin' stuff back. Where is it? It's all gonna be, like, right down in... It's gonna be basically right at the top of... I see the XP balls, so... 
Okay, okay, okay. Let's grab my stuff. Grab all my stuff. And I'm gonna, let's see if there's a creeper. Did both the zombies get blown up? All right, I'm just gonna run back down my hole real quick. Put my thing, where is my hole? I keep losing it, this is a problem. Okay, so it has to be right there. Oh my gosh, okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I have realized that I have a weird and random collection of things in my inventory. Like, what's going on with that? I really need to keep it a little more clean. Oh, cobblestone. Fancy. Alright, can I grab this iron or should I set some more torches first? Torches are great. Let's set a torch there. And I feel like, I feel like I, like, lowered my mob sounds a lot more than what is coming through on my headphones. But again, I've never played with headphones, so I really, like, I don't have a good concept for how my audio is until I edit the video. Which is an issue for you guys, I can imagine. Like, my first couple videos, that audio was terrible. And I am so sorry. That was, like, actually really bad. Oh, there's water. Imagine that. Whatever. Seriously. Right, we're gonna just up and up and... Oh my gosh, they're all right there. They're spawning just out of that lake. All right, let's deal with the zombie first. Because there's three <coughs> creepers. <coughs> also, <coughs> also, like, swinging the sword is very different here. Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. Um, and there's iron right there. Fancy. Alright, I don't want to encounter all those critters at once. So, let's head over this way. I still haven't made it out of, like, this corner of the cave. What the heck? <laughs> I'm better than this. I can do this. Oh, there's an enderman. Let's not get him mad at us. Like, oh, the lava sounds cool, though. I have to be careful. Swing it. Ah! All right. Is it just the one? I can take on one. I hate that I can't spam the sword, though. Oh, <laughs> there's another dude. Ah, he's going to go around the lava. Oh, that was a creeper behind me, wasn't it? Uh, Alright, how are we doing? Okay. This dude can act... Uh, ah! I was getting a call. And I uh, got distracted. Let's, uh... Yeah. Huh. Um... I'm gonna go ahead and eat just this real quick. Ugh, the age-old trick. Can I pick up the one thing, oh my gosh, without picking up the rotten flesh? All right, let's move that real quick. I don't want to see it, but I know I'll pick up more, so. Oh, there's copper right there. That's fancy. There, oh goodness. I was going to say, there was a creeper over there, so things are still spawning in that area. All right, where'd he go? All right. The trick is to not get shot, but also, 
kill him. Ah, there he is. He's down there. Alright. Where's his little head gonna come up? Do we have a truce? A Call it a draw? I do wish that I had a bow. That would be great. But alas. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can't. There we go. Light that area up too. Alright. That sounds like a number of skellies there. See if I can't get a little bit of coal out of that. My apologies to the glow lichen. Oh. It goes underground there. Ah! There's a bunch of there's a bunch of creepies. Creepy crawlies of various sorts right there. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> yeah. Um. Uh, I love my bow and arrows. I really need... Really need them. Um. You know what? I'm wondering. I was looking over this direction. I'm wondering if. Oh, there's the Enderman again. He's carrying something. Cutie. I, oh! Crap, crap, crap. Did I look at him? Okay, he doesn't seem to be mad. So that's cool. Alright, let's just shoot. Kind of get this area lit up! Ah! Bob and weave, right? Huh. <sighs> okay. But like, if it's just one skelly, I can deal with one skelly. And it's just not... Like... I keep getting spawns just like... F of huge, huge amounts of creepers and skellies all at once and that's just not a combination I am a fan of so ah! all right let's get you ha I got him look at that I'm so cool there's a zombie over there let's just and we do a little run and ha <laughs> Ha! All right. Come get me, my mans. All right. Take that. And that. And that! Oh my gosh. Careful of the lava. Ah! That's a heckin' creeper, and I do not want to run into the lava on accident while fighting, so let's not do that. But I think... The two sides of the cave are far enough apart that the creepy guys, like, despawn on the other side. Let's see if that theory is correct or if I'm about to run into a giant. Okay. 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 <gasps> yes. Awesome sauce. Let's just check here, too. Like, we'll go there. Okay. Ooh, that's some copper. I'm very curious as to what's down there. Uh, er, not copper, iron. Ooh, lots and lots and lots and lots of iron. All right. Ah! Ah! <laughs> run and torch, run and torch. Ah! Oh. <laughs> All right, come after me. My man's. Dice, 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 
<sighs> they take so long to die with the stone swords. Oh, there's a bunch of them. Is there anything else after me? <sighs> it's so loud, though. <laughs> Okay. Cool, cool, cool. All right. I'm going to grab just a little bit more iron and then head up and make myself some stuff. Some goodies. I feel like I keep hearing noises that are not good. All right. Can I get that, please? <sighs> okay. Okay. I haven't even made it to the other side of the cave yet. I'm going to come right back down. I will. I promise. <laughs> if I can find my way back out. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Well. I am all suited up. Oh, fell off another edge there. I'm all suited up, and yeah, I have currently opted to go without a helmet, but we'll see. There's still more iron smelting, too. I'm rich! Okay, so let's keep going. Enderman is still down here. Good for him. Alright, let's see if... Oh my gosh! Is that another Enderman, or is that just heckin' no? That's that's two Endermen in here. Oh gosh. That uh, that goes down there. Quite a ways. Let's grab this iron. <laughs> I keep falling off edges here. Good times. All around. Aw, the glow lichen's so pretty. I like that light. That's a cool light. I've been kind of thinking about what I want to build. And I would like to have, like, something in this, like, savanna, acacia area. What is that sound? I have exactly zero clue. Wait. It sounds kind of like the geodes. Is there like a geode under me somewhere maybe? Is that... I don't know what that is, and I don't know if it's ominous or cool. Like that sounds like geode, but this is this is what is happening. I'm like a little nervous about it, cause like I don't like it's not for me walking either. <laughs> I don't know if that's a sound I should chase or avoid. Like. You can get hurt by falling on dripstone, right? Huh. <sighs> that is pretty down there, though. I don't. Whew. I'm not exactly sure, like, how to go about getting down there. We're going to use this little, like, thing to go down a ways. And, oh. What the heck? 
It sounds like... <gasps> There's glow squid? Do the glow squid make that jingling sound? I am... I think I've mentioned this. Very bad at swimming. Like, I can't see well. And the water's flowing there. So I think... What I might want to do is grab a bucket and get the water still again. Because I feel like... If I'm trying to fight flowing water, that's just not going to end well for me in a cave. I drowned under the ice in Skyrim. I'm going to go do a little bit while it's light outside, and then we'll probably... I want to ask my husband about the sounds. <laughs> um, so, yeah. I got a lot more iron, too. Okay, so I decided to go ahead and plant my bamboo just kind of here in front of the mouth of the cave. I don't know. I thought that would be cool. Um, anyways, I wanted to talk about some things since uh, I have um, actually like s finished setting up my channel since like my first couple of recordings. Um, so... I mentioned, uh, if you haven't noticed already, in the first few episodes, we've used uh, different pieces of, like, what's generally considered classical music. Um, I mentioned historical music on the, uh, the, like, about page on my, on my, um, channel. So... My degree is music with an emphasis in sound engineering um, and and composition. Um, but I wanted to like use some of that like, I don't know, passion I found for not just like classical music, which I, you know, grew up playing um, and performing, but also world music in general. Um, the fun part of all of that is, of course, um, finding things that are royalty-free to use, so thus the historical part, um, so that I can use public domain music. Um, yeah, so I just thought that's the fun part of me that I can integrate into this. So I just wanted to like explain that and if anybody like has suggestions for me, I always would love to take them. Um, I like finding new music. This is so satisfying. This is ridiculous. Um, but I love finding new music and I love sharing it with people and like I gosh. I feel like it's it's underappreciated. Um, a lot of people, like, associate classical music with snobbery, which, like, they're not completely wrong. But, um, classical musicians are, like, the meanest people in the music world. Um. <laughs> but. It's also something that I really love. And I, I wish more people, like, um. Yeah. Participated with. Um, one thing that unfortunately I can't do is feature some of my favorite, my new favorite stuff, which is basically crossover of like metal and classical music. Um, my husband loves metal and we've discovered the old, uh, combination of metal and classical and it's just very cool and I love it um but can't do that um windows are copyright 
That is terrifying. That is so many animals. It is utterly horrifying. So I realized that um, my mob sounds are very low. And so you guys couldn't hear very well what I was hearing down in here. Um, I did go and look it up and confirm that glow squid do indeed make that sparkling twinkly sound. Um, so that's what I was hearing. Let's get that there. Um, that's what I was hearing there. So that wasn't an amethyst in water, which actually makes me kind of sad. And now I want to experiment with that and like, you know see if you could actually do something like that. I don't know. That that seems very cool to me. So I really want to go down here. Um The issue is, of course, I'm not sure how I want to go down, and there's a lot of dripstone that I could fall onto. Um, I was hoping there was, like, some way that I could, like, actually just, like, walk down, but that really doesn't seem like an option. That, I wonder if slash how I could get to that water there. I actually probably could take this water down to the bottom, couldn't I? Um, see if I can't reach over there somewhere. I can't. Huh. Actually, what if I... Ah! Oh! Oh! Oh, 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 okay. Okay, that's not what I meant to do at all. I thought I was being clever. And, uh... Oh. This is fancy. Fancy schmancy. I thought I was being clever and was going to block off the the water from flowing so that I could, you know, access this area here. Uh, I was convinced there that I was going to uh, end up on the bottom of that cave without any mental preparation whatsoever. Okay, cool. I wanted to see if I could access this area from that side without having to do some precarious over the water thing. And I can't. And I also definitely hear a skelly somewhere. Oh gosh. My hesitation with going down the waterfall is, can I get back up? Oh, there's a slime. Oh, slimes are heckin' cool. Oh, goodness. Hey, friends. I'm sorry I have to kill you right now. I'll get a pet one of you later. I promise. You guys are really cute. Is that all the slime balls? I only got two out of that. Well, I have uh, absolutely no clue what I'm gonna face down there. <laughs> So, that's exciting, to say the least. Let's, let's do it. <laughs> oh, oh. Ah! 
crap, crap, crap. I swear. No, 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 no. Okay. That was almost really bad. But that is also why I, uh, went back and left a lot of my, like, valuable inventory. Uh, ah! Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. Where was he? Where was he? Where was he? Oh! broke a bed. Good thing I'm right next to spawn anyways. <sighs> oh my gosh. I am actually shaking. <sighs> that was crazy. I did not land a single hit there. Gosh, poor baby. All right, <laughs> are we ready for take two? <laughs> oh my gosh, here we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh, okay. Now, the trick is, of course, to figure out where I died. I think it was up over in here. And there's a spider already, so that's exciting. I think. I'm gonna just, ooh, redstone. I literally have, okay, this must be it. Yeah, here we are. Okay. Items. Um. Huh. <sighs> cool, cool. All right, let's light this place up a bit more. There's a zombie already. It's awesome. It's great. Nothing to worry about at all. Huh. <sighs> Here, light that up. I do appreciate that there is a good amount of lava down here. Oh my gosh, that's a spider after me, isn't it? Yep, he is. Okay. Um, another thing, my husband, like, watches a lot of things while, like, I'm editing or, like, right after I record them. And he, ever so graciously, oh, not going to a creeper, he ever so graciously informed me after a lot of my fighting earlier in this episode, um, <laughs> that the more hits you land on a zombie, the more chance it has to uh, spawn another zombie in Java. I'm like, oh, that's exciting. Definitely. Ah! Not an issue. Okay. You come here, you little annoying man. There's a zombie. I feel like little annoying man just kind of applies to like all zombie or all mobs, monster things in this game. I am not sure how to get home actually now. So that's exciting. Whoa! A tiny bit of lag and I almost fell down in there. Is this, is this, yeah, with that diamond right there. Do I have like two seconds to like 
There we go. Cool. Okay. I don't feel like anybody is currently after me. Though I hear a zombie. Yep, yeah, he's after me. He's a zombie. He's a... Zombies are mostly just annoying, which is, I guess, nice. Dripstone's a little sketch, though. Dude, this is such a cool cave, though. I am a fan. This is cool. Alright. We have a little staircase down. And we can, like, you know torches and we can waterfall all the way down there if we want but there's a creeper so we don't want to right now but oh my gosh this is so cool I love it oh my goodness wanted to grab whatever redstone is down here for one thing and then any diamonds that I might see. And then I think we will call that a happy, happy ending. Come on. Yes, the sound effects are necessary. <laughs> Not the dog sound effects, though. Those are just annoying. This is such a cool cave. I love this. Like, despite all my fear of caves in general and monsters and all those things. I am absolutely a fan of this one. Can we talk about how weird the like popping sound is of the of the uh, deep slate? Aww, bat! One thing that I oh said earlier, and uh, my husband confirmed for me, is that you can indeed get hurt by falling on dripstone. All right, got him. Okay. Any other like spots down here that I? Ah! Oh, is there possibly a skelly spawner down here? Because that would be awesome. Just like considering that I've gotten to two skellies in just like one second down here. I would love that. That would be cool. Nope. <laughs> of course not. <clears throat> Redstone is something that I've been uh, wanting slash needing at this point. I'm ready to like start making some cool farms and whatnot, I think. Like I said a while ago, I don't, like, have, like, a specialty or anything, but I am very fascinated by redstone. Well, obviously I don't have a specialty. I'm brand new at this. Um, I should probably, like, leave myself a little, like, breadcrumb trail or something on, like, how to get home. That's all glow liking up there, isn't it? I'm going to light this area up a little bit more, too. Because I want my diamonds. <gasps> Do I not have space? Oh, no. Alright, moment of truth. Can I swim my way home? This is going to be interesting, to say the least. Oh, no, 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 no. 
Oh no. You know what? You know what? I have stone. I am going to just pillar up. Oh, this is probably where I was hearing those guys before. <laughs> My dog just made a very dramatic noise. Oh, that's a skelly. Sound right there. room for this either? What else can I get rid of? That sound is making me nervous. Honestly. Bye bye tough. Ah! I made it! <laughs> All right. We have returned to the surface and let us take a look at the, I don't know, spoils, the plunder. We got some gunpowder, which I didn't even kill the creeper. The creeper killed the other creeper. We have a stack and a bit of redstone, which is a good start anyways, <laughs> at least for me. Um, we got some mob drops and we have two shiny diamonds and uh, iron that I've already put in the furnace here. So just a few iron, but you know what? It's nice. Let's just drop a little bit more in there for charcoal. Just because that's nice to have around. You know what's interesting is I have not yet picked up a bow. I might have to just make one at this point. I have enough string for it. Or I could make a fishing rod. I could make a fishing rod. I actually really like that idea. Um, I, I actually really like idea. The sheer amount of random tools that I have in my inventory is amazing. Can you tell I have a lot of confidence in myself? <laughs> Go. Alright. Well, that's looking better. Anyways, and you know, we're gonna go ahead and do that because why not? Oh, and it only uses two string. That's amazing. I legitimately cannot tell what time it is. Well, it has been an adventure for sure. Oh, is that a... I, I... Hmm, <laughs> fishing from this angle is interesting. Um, but yes, we went caving today. And I got armor and fancy things and made myself a fishing pole. So, I hope... Oh. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this episode um, and that it was uh, a little more entertaining um, 
Yeah, I feel like, I don't know, it was an interesting episode, to say the least, and it is actually getting dark. <gasps> oh, leather, look at that! Um, actually, just one second. As I was saying, it's been a good episode. I liked this one. This one was a lot of fun. Um, challenging myself and putting myself out of my comfort zone is a pretty great thing. Um, I hope I didn't blast any eardrums with screaming and shrieking and whatnot. I am, um, a little, a little bit, <laughs> this is so interesting. I'm a little bit timid, but hey, I got past it today and you know, I'm proud of that. I think that's a really great thing. So for all of you out there, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and <laughs> Another fish. Um, and have a great day, and I hope to see you around soon. Bye. Oh my gosh, I just got an enchanted object. What is it? I think it was a fishing rod. Mending. Okay, okay. We can, we can work with that. I have been waiting to get an enchanted object for